This is Mike from AMF Wood Shop. Today I'm going to build something to get me a little bit organized here in the shop. Here really recently I've gotten into uh, painting some of my projects. Um, I've been using these uh, little acrylic paints. Uh, come to find out they're actually pretty handy and uh, the kids like them. I like them. So I got about uh, I don't know, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 16 different bottles and collars and uh, I'm just going to make something to uh, store them all. And uh, that's what today's project is. Don't go anywhere and uh, we'll see you at the end. Alright, the setup that I got is a uh, board on the bottom, uh, 20, and a, 20, 20 and a quarter inches. I got two little spacer blocks, they are 2 inches and the width of everything is five inches. So the idea there is to put those in there like that, put this one on top, drill a couple holes, set my bottles in. So I'm gonna glue these up, pin them in, and then uh, work on the whole layout. Okay, um, I got the lines laid out for the front row and the back row. That's essentially, that right there is essentially how they're going to go. Then I'm going to have a third bottle or a third row right here in the middle. Now I didn't fuss over each individual line to make sure they were all spaced right. I just went by eye and they all came out to really close to two and a half inches. But now what I want is a third line going this way but I do want it in the middle of these two lines. Well this measures out to let's see, two and five eighths and you know you could do the math and figure out what half is but let me show you an easy way to do it you take your two reference lines or reference points line that up on your ruler or tape measure or whatever and on the first point put it on the one or zero however you want to do it but make it and then adjust your ruler to the second line to make it an easy number to divide by two. So in this case I got my point on one and my point on four which is three inches. So I know an easy reference of uh, half of three inches is one and a half. So I can come down one and a half which is right here and now I got the center of that line without doing a bunch of math. Okay, I got the crosshairs laid out for this hole and this hole. Now I want the crosshair this way for the center lines. And I'm going to use the exact same method to find the center. So I got it on zero. I'm going to tilt this up to 
tilt it down to six. So three is my halfway mark on the ruler. And that right there is the center of the board. that middle row up just a little bit so that's all I'm doing now And I'm doing the same thing with the back row. In this case, I'm adding two boards instead of one. And a couple staples to hold it. Alright, and there it is. Completed project. I got uh, room for 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20 bottles. And uh, fairly lightweight, even with the glue in there, it's not too bad. And uh, that just makes it a little easier to uh, use when I do need it. Um, like I said before, the kids use them all the time. and. I've been using them 
quite a bit lately. I actually used all these for my Superman Whirly gig. And uh, I'll probably be using them for my birdhouse soon. And uh, took me maybe uh, maybe a half hour total. Um, that's even including sanding. So not bad project. Simple enough. And uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.